welcome to Rome Italy when I, when I talk about Rome Rome have 3000 years of history the city was built 3000 years ago I have spent my whole day watching all of these buildings which was built in 3000 2000 years ago and still still they are discovering buildings and pathways and many many things in Rome every time they try to dig the, the soil here to make a metro station or metro lines they find something new so they need to change the route of metro lines that's why they couldn't finish an underground metro in, in Rome if you take the history of Rome Rome was started BC 1000 uh, it means before Christ 1000 years before Christ and they have been developing the city the Rome city with modern buildings and lot of lot of things they are used to do but the problem what happened in Rome was was hit by many many natural calamities earthquakes many times happened and it's not a small shakes so it was very really a big uh, earthquake happened so here you can see the history what happened uh, in in 15 AD the city was destroyed uh, partial and again 2080 it was caused a very big fire in the theater of uh, uh, Colosseum and in 89 191 the passage was destroyed and in 258 of AD 1000 uh, houses was being collapsed uh, due to earthquakes and again AD 443 the Colosseum was hit by a very big uh, earthquake so Rome facing a lot of uh, natural calamities uh, throughout their uh, their time Arch of Constantine Italian Arco di Costantino is a triumphal arch in Rome dedicated to the Emperor Constantine the Great the arch was commissioned by the Roman Senate to commemorate Constantine's victory over Maxentius at the Battle of Milvian Bridge in AD 312. Situated between the Colosseum and the Palatine Hill, the arch spans the Via Triumphalis, the route taken by victorious military leaders when they entered the city in a triumphal procession. Dedicated in 315, it is the largest Roman triumphal arch, with overall dimensions of 21 m high, 25.9 m wide and 7.4 m deep. It has three bays, the central one being 11.5 m high and 6.5 m wide and the laterals 7.4 m by 3.4 m each. The arch is constructed of brick-faced concrete revetted in marble. The arch, which was constructed between 312 and 315 AD, was dedicated by the Senate to commemorate 10 years of Constantine's reign, 306 to 337, and his victory over the then reigning Emperor Maxentius, 306 to 312, at the Battle of Milvian Bridge on October 28, 312, as described on its Attic inscription, and officially opened on July 25, 315. Not only did the Roman Senate give the arch for Constantine's victory, they also were celebrating decennia, a series of games that happens every decade for the Romans. The arch, which was constructed between 312 and 315. On this occasion they also said many prayers. However, Constantine had actually entered Rome on October 29, 312, amidst great rejoicing, and the Senate then commissioned the monument. Constantine then left Rome within two months and did not return till 326.
Arch of Dolabella and Silanus, Latin, Arcus Dolabella et Silani, or Arch of Dolabella is an ancient Roman arch. It was built by senatorial decree in 1080 by the consuls P. Cornelius Dolabella and C. Junius Silanus. The arch is located on the Caelian Hill, at the north corner of the site of the Castra Peregrina. It spans the modern Via Dias Paolo della Croce, along the line of the ancient Clivis Scori. Its location indicates that it was a rebuilding of one of the gates of the Servian Wall, though which one is unclear, possibly the Porta Quirquidilana, or Quirquitilaria, or the Porta Se Limentana. Although the latter is considered the more likely original, there is no indication that any important road went out of the city through the Se Limentana. Temple of Claudius, Latin, Templum Divi Claudii, also variously known as the Temple of the Divis Claudius, the Temple of the Divine Claudius, the Temple of the Deified Claudius, or in an abbreviated form as the Claudium, one, was an ancient structure that covered a large area of the Caelian Hill in Rome, Italy. It housed the imperial cult of the Emperor Claudius, who was deified after his death in 54 AD.
The extension of the Aqua Claudia undertaken during the reign of Nero made use of the Arch of Dolabella for the last section. Its original purpose was probably to support a branch of the Aqua Martia.